Hi! Let's work on this integral on this Friday night. The integral of 1 over 1 plus e to the x dx. Okay, maybe let's use the u substitution first. Why not? That u equals to 1 plus e to the x, and then as the usual procedure, du is equal to e to the x dx, dx is equal to du over e to the x, but then take this integral into the u world, I will get 1 over u, and then dx becomes du over e to the x. Here's a small problem. We still have this e to the x. It is still possible to solve for e to the x right here and then say e to the x is equal to u minus 1. We don't need to do that. In fact, if you do that, the question is going to be much harder and then it requires what we call the partial fraction technique. So this is not what we want. And now let's think about a different strategy to solve this integral. And the usual way of thinking is you should think about how to make things happen. Look at this expression and ask yourself, perhaps you'll say, wouldn't it be better instead of the one on top only, if you have one plus e to the x over one plus e to the x, wouldn't this be much easier, right? Because if you have one plus e to the x over one plus e to the x, the whole thing is just going to be one. But then you cannot just add the e to the x yourself because you change the whole thing, you change the whole question, right? However, we can still do that. After you add e to the x on the numerator, just make sure that you immediately subtract e to the x on the numerator as well. And in that case, we didn't change the value of the integration. By doing that, I am going to take this apart. I'm going to split the fraction. This is the same as saying integral. I'm going to pair this up together, 1 plus e to the x over the denominator, 1 plus e to the x and then minus the second fraction, which is e to the x over 1 plus e to the x dx. And let me take one more step. Let me write this into two different integrals. Um, for the first one, it's the integral of, well, this expression is just going to be 1. So let me write it down, 1. And then let me also attach the dx. All right? So I'm going to focus on how to solve this integral right here, which is super easy. And then minus the second part, the integral of this expression, e to the x over 1 plus e to the x. And then also have the dx, like this. And now, this first part, integral of 1 in the x world, is just equal to x. And that's it. And we also have to work out the second integral. The integral of e to the x over 1 plus e to the x can be solved by using the u substitution now. I'll say u is equal to the denominator, 1 plus e to the x. And then to differentiate, I will get du equals to e to the x dx. And dx is the same as du over e to the x. So I can take this integral into the u world. And this is going to be, let me just do it right here. Integral e to the x on the top over 1 plus e to the x is what we said to be u. So I have the u right here. And then dx is du over e to the x right here. And now as you can see, this e to the x and that e to the x cancel out. So this expression right here is much easier to work with compared to the original expression. All right? And now in the u world, this is the same as the integral 1 over u du. And the integral of 1 over u is just ln absolute value of u, right? And then to finish this up, let me put on the subtraction. And then this integral is the same as ln absolute value of u. And how to just change back u is equal to 1 plus e to the x. So I'll put this back in here. I will have ln 1 plus e to the x. And here I have the absolute value, but then I know that 1 is positive plus e to the x, it's never zero or neg never negative. So I don't really need to use the absolute value. I can just use the parentheses. That will be it. So this is this, this is that. All together, we are done. So just make sure that we put plus c right here. So I call this the strategy of how to make things happen. Wouldn't it be nice if you can have this instead of the original, right? So try to make things happen when you are trying to solve the integral. That's the best idea.